Our focus now, a man from the U.S. state of Utah who made violent online threats to President Joe Biden has been shot dead by FBI agents. Exactly. Now, this incident occurred just hours before President Biden landed for his first official visit to the state. Now, according to the FBI, the federal agents were trying to serve a warrant on the home of the man identified as Craig Deleu Robertson when the shooting happened. Now, previously, Robertson had also made several, as I mentioned, threatening posts on social media. On Monday, Robertson allegedly made a threat referencing Biden's trip to Utah this week. The suspect posted that he needed to prepare his camouflage suit and sniper rifle. Robertson was already facing three federal charges, including threats against the president, as well as influencing, impeding and retaliating against federal law enforcement officers by threat. The man also made threats against Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg, as the attorney led a criminal inquiry into former President Donald Trump. Biden has been reportedly briefed about the incident by the Secret Service. Now for more on this, our correspondent Susan Therani has sent us this report from New York. Listen in. The FBI said that they had credible threat that this former Air Force vet was planning on assassinating Joe Biden. He was also threatening for some time uh, to harm former President Barack Obama and other officials as well. The FBI also said that he was the owner of multiple machine guns and handguns and also a special camouflage suit that he bragged about online. The FBI, however, did not say what instigated Wednesday's shooting, but it did happen just shortly before President Joe Biden was due to arrive in Salt Lake City, Utah, about 45 minutes away from this individual's home. Susan Tehrani reporting from New York for We On World Is One.